Welcome to Gaming Has Begun and welcome to the Rules for Lunchtime Gaming. So for those who are wanting to watch the series, this video will be telling you what the rules are for Lunchtime Gaming. And they will be the following. Rule number one. The game must be able to be saved or finished within the 30 minute period that the game is played. Now, this is quite simple to understand. There must be somewhere that you'll be able to save or it auto saves or you must be able to actually finish the game without having to speed run the whole game and miss a whole pile of stuff. Rule number two. Not more than 33% of the starting of the game can be non-playable. So this means watching loads of cutscenes or watching as the characters do things and you don't get to interact with things. That sort of particular thing. Because at the end of the day, you want to be actually playing the game, not watching the whole thing and how it's done and whatever else. So it must be less than 10 minutes of it being non-playable. Rule number three, you can return. So this applies to areas where you start off the game. You must be able to return to that area to search for anything that you've missed or um, uh, potentially hidden, little jokes, etc. You must be able to return to this first little area. Or, you must be able to save within that area. So, if it's non-returnable, there must be a save point in that area for you to be able to save and come back to it later and explore the rest of it. So, it could be like a little mini-game or hidden stuff or collectibles that you can't get at any other time. So, there must be a save point within that area to allow you to go back and get those things. Rule number four. The main event must be explained or at least started to be explained. So I understand with some games, they will slowly drip feed you the story as you go through, and the person who you think you're fighting is not actually the person, etc, etc. Well, there's a heck of a twist in it. But I don't want a situation where you're guessing and guessing and guessing about what's this game about right through the whole 30 minutes. And finally, the fifth rule. Tutorial stuff has finished, or at least the basic stuff's finished. Now, in some games, you will get a, um, a basic tutorial or a little bit of a tutorial, and then you get a bit more a little bit later on. But this is where I don't want a system where you go into the game and your entire 30 minutes is purely tutorial, or you're getting just these little snippets here and a little snippet there, and you end up having to play for an hour or two hours to get the actual basic mechanics of the entire game. Now, an example of this is in Dark Chronicles. Uh, for those who are in the US, it's Dark Cloud 2. You get a idea of how to do um, some things in the first level, and the first few levels, but then you get a little bit more here when you get another character. There is a bit where it explains how to improve your tools in the second chapter. This is the sort of thing I want to try and avoid. How you've got a basic here, but then you get more of a basic bit over there, and the basic bit over there, and let's cut that. The basic tutorial has to be finished within that 30 minutes. You can have more advanced tutorials later on, that's fine, but the basic tutorial has to have finished. So, they're the rules for lunchtime gaming. And stick around and you will see the first video popping up on the screen at the end of this. And I hope to see you throughout the series. I've been Matt. Welcome to Gaming Has Begun, Lunchtime Gaming. <laughs>